Hello everyone, if you are a researcher and you read scholarly articles often from archive.org and you also want to stay updated about the recent developments, the, about the recently published preprints from archive.org, this video is for you, stay tuned. And as you know, archive.org includes um, nearly 2.4 million scholarly articles in in different fields like physics, mathematics, computer science, etc., as you can see here. But now there is a specific AI tool which is built to keep you updated about the published papers, specifically in the fields that you are a researcher or maybe you are not a researcher but just a reader and you want to keep yourself updated about the recent developments. It's called Archive Pulse, as you can see here, and you can basically as it, as it mentions here you can get clear and easy to read summaries of archive preprints that are directly relevant to your research and i'm going to show you how you can do it you can try so this tool is not free it is you can test it for only one dollar for seven days and then you can decide if you want to continue for with further using to use it simply you can just log in with your gmail account which i did so i'm going to do that again and after signing in it is very simple interface where you can create these pulses so basically the pulse is an interest area that you want to get a newsletter about and here i've already done one i created an artificial intelligence pulse and which i already received an email for, about it and it's very easy just click on this create new button if you get if you want to get simply a general digest you can tick here but if you want to create a specific pulse in accordance to your research needs or your just interest needs and you can type here which i did uh, artificial intelligence and you can select the categories which I did computer science and you can again select subcategory you can select multiple subcategories here and you can select the frequency frequency it is in which frequency you want to receive those newsletters about the the newly published articles you can it, it can be daily it can be in two three days or weekly updates as per your wish I usually go with weekly and confirm and then create newsletter and if you when you create that you will have this here you can also edit pulse you can delete pulse and when you do that you will start receiving those newsletters about this pulse uh, and it will definitely send the articles which uh, in compliance with your needs i received one of those emails today which is uh, including the summaries of the articles recently published articles about it and it, it also grabs some images from those articles as well like uh, as you can see here and if you want to read the full article you can of course create you can of course uh, click on this link here like uh, this one is inter looks interesting to me for example and if i click on it and you can directly navigate to the website from archive.org to that very article and then if you click on view pdf button you can have you can access basically to the full article you can download it you can save it etc so this is basically the archive pulse so that's basically it for this video. You can, as I mentioned, this tool is not free. You can use it. You can test it for seven days for one United States dollar. But if you like it, you can upgrade your plan. You can go with monthly or annual plans. Here you can see the pro plan or ultra plan. With pro plan, you can create 10 research pulses. But with the ultra plan, it is unlimited, as you can see here. And if you use annual, you are going to save. On top of that, I have discount codes with Bugar20. You can save 20% on each of these monthly plans. But if you go with annual and if you use Bugar40, you are going to save 40%. You will have 40% discount on annual plans, either on Pro or Ultra plan. So that's it. I hope you liked this video. Please hit like and subscribe button to support my channel. Peace.